This is my reaction to Yu-Gi-Oh! Season 1, Episode 31, Keith's Machinations, Part 1. In the last episode, Mai and Yugi finished off their duel after Yugi decided to let the alter ego of himself take control, and he was able to win and come back with some super magic rare card thing that happens. And Mai ended up forfeiting thing because she knew she couldn't win. Now I'm assuming we're going to have Keith and Joey's battle? If Joey realizes he doesn't have his card and is able to fix that. We'll see. Also, if you like full reaction to Yu-Gi-Oh! and other shows I react to, you can join my Patreon, which will be linked down below. So, yeah, let's go. The first match of these playoffs has come to a close. Yugi Moto has emerged victorious over my Valentine. Mm. He Guess I'm kind of tense. Yeah, huh? you got a few reasons to be. First off, look who you're going up against. Bandit Keith, the Intercontinental Champion. I mean, the guy makes his living out of winning prize money from tournaments just like these. Yeah. He still didn't realize that I'm the card, does he? Yeah, I? there's our man. Go, Joey! Yeah. Huh? What's the deal? Where's Keith? Oh, there he is. What time is it? Yeah. What are you doing? Get over here! Hey, chill out. The pummeling will commence as soon as I'm good and ready, so don't get your briefs in a bunch. You got that, Blondie? Stall as long as you want. Can you call him but Blondie you're if you're also blonde? Sooner or later. <laughs> That's what you think, you dork. <laughs> Tournament verification cards, gentlemen. Oh. No problem. Joey lost his tournament entry card? He couldn't be that absent-minded. Yeah, he mm. could. Well, what a shame. I guess I won't be needing to get up off of this couch after all, huh, Joey? Well, if we move to the, the final, then you need to battle Yugi regardless. If you find it within the set so you still need to get out. Spineless, I'd say. No way! What? Joey has never backed down from a duel before. Yeah. He's not going to start to now. I mean, Joey's a lot of things. You'll see. But he's not one to, like, get, like, cower. Believe what you want. He tends to go in overcommon and then fail. Miserably. Oh. Get up off the floor, Joey. Oh. And quit all your crying already. You look like a big baby. <laughs> oh, she didn't give him hit like her card. Something in my eye. Stupid. She doesn't anymore. Come out. Here. Huh? Anyway, see you around, hun. There's a card in there. Yeah. Mai's card. Wait, Mai. Take it. I don't need it anymore. So, does this mean that we're finally friends, Mai? Don't you have a duel to run on? Yeah, to? you have like a minute left. One thing no. though. I'm sure in real time he ran out of time. Take him down. Huh? Right. Dork. Of course we're friends. <clears throat> Let me guess. You couldn't find that card anywhere. <laughs> what are you talking mm. about? I got it right here. So I think I'll switch my card to Ooh. attack mode. Go, Pendulum Machine! A machine monster? That's right. And he's about to go into overdrive on that defense card of yours. Uh, slashing Blade Attack! Uh, ouch! That's not good. Well, it isn't bad. Huh? Yugi is right. Now that Keith's card is set in attack mode, Joey can see precisely how strong it is. Now all he has to do is play something stronger, and he'll be able to destroy it. Mm. Still... Soul Spear! Attack! Now oh, what? My attack's not working! Huh? Great Scott, it's not! Yug, that can't be right, can it? <laughs> hmm? You bet it's right. All of my machine monsters are protected by magic resistant armor. So that makes all of your magic attacks worth squat. <laughs> That's why he played a machine. Mm. They're magic proof and not just against magical type monsters, but they can withstand attacks from any card that uses magic. Man, can we ever catch a break? <sighs> my turn. Huh? And I got another well-oiled machine all ready for you. Launch your spider. <laughs> More machines, just great. His whole deck is probably full of them. Yeah. Hmm. If this guy keeps throwing cards in defensive mode, I'll never get at his life points. Mm. I gotta draw him out, get him to attack me. Then I'll be open for some real damage. 
I'll lay a card face down too. And this in defense. Whoa. Oh. My mistake. Just forget what you saw. Anyhow, as I was saying, I'll play this card in defense mode. Whatever that was, it sure looked ugly. But not metal. <laughs> Did you that purpose? Tristan's right. That card wasn't a machine. It was a shadow monster called Zoa. A beast my flame swordsman could toast easily. And unlike machine monsters, it's totally vulnerable to magic. <laughs> yeah, check out Joey's big grin. Something's up. I don't know. I think that was trap. Unless Keith is trying to lure Joey into attacking him. Mm. No, Salamandra. His magic raises my attack power by 700 points. So then Keith must have shown Zoa on purpose. Joey, wait. Swordsman, attack! Ugh, I gotcha. My trap activates. What? Go, Magic Metal Force. Now Zoa is Metal Zoa. 400 attack and defense Ooh. points stronger. Nah, no big thing. But that's not all, Blondie. That new metallic Again, are you able to call him Blondie if you are also blonde? Attacks back to where they came from. My I feel like that negates the purpose. That's right. Just watch this card of yours. But he won't be defended much longer. A stop defense card? Mm. Let's see what you're hiding there. Hmm. An axe raider, huh? No problem. Not for my metal Zoe anyway. Oh no, Joey's life points will be all gone if that Metal Zoa's attack hits. Hang tough, bud. Sayonara, sucker. Metal Zoa, attack the Axe Raider. What? Huh? Where'd he go? Of course. Huh? Nice move. Huh? All right. You fell right in my trap, just like I planned. Oh, no so. way. You set a trap for me? And at first I'm laying his face down. Oh, and it's a trap card, so don't bother attacking. Wow. Will you Damn. just look at him duel? Careful. You haven't won this duel yet, Joey. You amateur. That's got to be the lousiest bluff I've ever heard in my entire dueling career. And next, I'm switching my axe raider back to defensive mode and throwing this in attack mode. Go, Garuzis! Now jump that pendulum machine! Attack! With Battle Blade Strike! Uh. Punk. Yeah, that's right. Take a permanent vacation at the scrapyard, you hunk of junk. Wrong again, Keith. You thought I was bluffing, and now you're gonna pay for it. What's that? Kunai with Chain. And once activated, uh. it uses my attack power 500 points. Attack, Garuzis! Battle Axe Crush! Uh, all right, it's still close, but Joey has just won himself a slight lead. I knew he'd make a comeback! <laughs> Joey's trusting his instincts and believing in his cards. He's dueling like a true champion. Way to go, Joey! If you keep this up, you'll be dueling Pegasus in no time! No, he's doing it for the money, not to fool Pegasus. I'm not gonna let him make a fool out of me. And then, I'll bring out my bigger machines and really give our audience a show. You're going down, you sniveling little wannabe. Nobody beats Bandit Keith. Mm. Nobody. That my reaction Yu-Gi-Oh! Season 1, Episode 31, Keith's ma Machinations. Part one. So Joey was not able to find his car, obviously, because Keith took it. But then Mai gave him hers, and he was able to com compete. And then in the duel, we saw that Keith was mainly using machine cards. And Joey actually seemed to be doing pretty good. He kept using traps and stuff, which was smart. But I don't know. We'll see how this wraps up. I don't know. So yeah, that's it.